Good day, everyone. Good day to our panelists and good day to our advisor, Ariel Rogon. We are the Group 1 and we are here to represent our research for a research entitled Online Computer Mediated Instructional Techniques in Learning Basic Calculus of STEM Students During Distance Learning. And here are my Group 1 members. And they are Narciso Nepomuceno III, Faustin Christian Co., James Clarence S. B. James Clarence Suay Bito, and yours truly, John Leomer B. Baxal. For our reason to choose this research, J James Clarence Bito will introduce it. The research that we conducted is entitled Online Computer Mediated Instructional Techniques in Learning Basic Calculus for STEM Students During Distance Learning. The reason why researchers conducted this study is that they wanted to know the new techniques that grade 11 STEM students use to study basic calculus, which is especially important now that we are in a new normal and also to be able to know if there is good effect from the techniques that they use in their grades in basic calculus. For our SOP1, what are the most commonly used online computer mediated instructional techniques during your online experience. And here are the results in our survey. And here is the results that we conduct when we use weighted mean. And for the final results, According to the results in question number one, it shows that the total of the STEM student uses new online computer-mediated instructional techniques is 3.66 mean. It represents that the majority of STEM students are likely or offend to use all these new online computer-mediated instructional techniques to learn basic calculus during their online experiences in the new normal. This concludes that they frequently, frequently have things that they can use so that they, they could learn basic calculus during these days that we were in the pandemic. For our SOP2, what are the effects of using an online computer in learning basic calculus to STEM students? And here are the results in our survey. And here are the results when we conduct weighted mean. And for the final results, Based on the data above, the result shows that learning of basic calculus by the STEM students using online computers have a big effect for them. In totality, the response shows that they all agreed that learning basic calculus using online computer have an effect to them with an average of 2.84 mean. This concludes that all of, the, all of them experiences a different effects in learning basic calculus using online computer during pandemic. For our SOP3, what is your first quarter grade in basic calculus? And here are the results in our survey. And here are the final results. As stated in the figure, 50% of the respondents or half of the respondents got the highest grade in basic calculus between 90 to 100 while 28.1% got a higher grade between 85 to 89, while the other 18.8% of the respondents got high grades between 80 to 84%, and only 1% got grades below 75. The figure shows that the majority of the respondents got better grades in basic calculus. This also means that most likely they can totally achieve their goal of having better grades in basic calculus using an online computer. And for our SOP4, is there significant relationship between the uses of online computer mediated instructional techniques and the academic performance of these STEM students? And this is the results. We use sample size of 10. 
and the result of significance level is 0 0.05. We use type of we use two tailed test for our computed value negative 0 0.30 for our critical value 0 0.63 0 0.6313 and our decision failed to reject hypothesis. And for conclusion, as shown in the table above, the hypothesis is failed to reject. True person are correlation with a sample size of 10. By calculating the computed value using the data from the survey gathered, researchers got a result of negative 0 0.30. In calculating the critical correlation value, the researchers use a significance level of 0 0.05 for a two-tailed test. Using also the data gathered from the survey, researchers got a result of 0 0.6313. Since the computed value is less than the critical value, the Nahala hypothesis is failed to reject. This shows that the use of online computer mediated is instructional techniques of STEM students has no positive correlation to their academic performance. Therefore, there is no significant relationship between the uses of online computer mediated instructional techniques and the academic performance of STEM students. For our references, That's all. Thank you. And also thank you to our panelists and for our advisor, Sir Ariel Rogon.